Hi everyone. So this is my eight week slash two month update on the Platinum Hair Extensions Virgin Brazilian Wavy Curly. Now this has have has got to be the most beautiful curl texture that I've ever ever had. I mean this curl texture is just I mean you can see <laughs> it has a wave but it still it still has like this curl at the end and it's so pretty I could talk with this hair forever. It just, if you put the right products in and you really take care of this hair, you will not regret this at all. No, I've had it in since the 24th of December and I, it's just like, there's something about the quality and the texture of this particular type of hair that makes you spend less time on it like for instance it it's just pretty on its own you don't have to do much at all my hair is semi semi damp um that's why it doesn't look so big and full i put a treatment in today and i wash it out and i always allow my hair to air dry so um it would retain the curl and it wouldn't have heat damage or anything like that now when you wash your hair or you treat your hair you could probably like toss it like this you know just go through it like that but don't run your hands through it because it will take away from the curl and you won't have the natural curl pattern so um that's why the curls look a little bit more defined today but like i was saying before this hair is so low maintenance you don't have to put a lot of products in this hair. The only thing I use is my regular paddle brush. I use edge control for my edges and then I would use um, an argan oil. I don't do wet stuff on this hair unless I'm washing because I find if you use too much wet stuff it causes a build up and then your hair is not bouncy and flowy and it doesn't you know it doesn't look like this. So that would be one of the reasons why I don't use wet stuff. Now this hair is 20 six, twenty four, twenty two, and twenty inches. So it's four bundles. At first it was just three and almost the full bundle of the fourth, the fourth bundle. So it would have been like three and a lot of the fourth bundle. But after you know your hair gets old it kinda kinda draws down. I put in the other piece so it's the whole four bundles in there now. And it has a really good length to it like really and it's really bouncy it moves when I walk it blows around it reaches me down to here it's really pretty the color is not fading it does wash out every time I wash my hair I would get a lot of red coming out like it bleeds a lot but it's not even though it bleeds a lot the color is not like fading out and looking dull or anything like that. Um, this is definitely going to be one of my curls that I really cherish. Because, like I said, it's low maintenance. I haven't really come across another curl that looks like this. This has a perfect mix between wavy and curly. Because wavy hair is like a body wave. It has like a slight, you know, nothing to shout about. Just a natural wave, almost straight. And then the curly hair, like Malaysian curly and those other textures, they're pretty, but they need a lot of maintenance and stuff. So this is personally my favorite texture. You don't have to do a lot with this at all. And I really care my hair well. If you care your hair well and you put, like, less is more. The less you do with this hair the better it looks. You just need to continually wash this hair. You need to, you know, put it up at night, put your oil in it, and just continue to follow your regime. You're allowed like an off night or probably three off nights or whatever. If you have good hair, it won't spoil like that, but just try to protect your investment because it's virgin hair, it's pricey continue with the regime at night braiding it up twisting it however you guys sleep with it get up in the morning put in your oil and go try to stay away from 
those wet products if you do like those wet products and you think you can't do without those products make sure you wash your hair at least every week and also use non-sulfate shampoos which are less harsh on your hair you will feel the difference you shampoos and conditioners you will feel the difference regular shampoos you don't really get a nice feel until you condition but with a non-sulfate shampoo from the time you condit you shampoo you already it already feels that you're putting in a conditioner so just remember those few tips on how to cure your hair and you should be good to go um i really love the red in it red is definitely an attention getter and um good and bad for me because i really loved red hair i don't mind the attention but it kind of limits me to my lip color and i'm really out there with my lip colors i don't shy away from any color at all but i found that with the red hair i have to be in this box this box of reds oranges pinks and corally colors so no purple no blue no and it kind of limits me. I just want to do, I want to get up and put on lipstick with my mood. So if I'm in a purple mood today, I really can't wear purple. Unless I put my hair back where you can't see the red. And then it probably may work for me. But that would be the only con to the red hair. You can't really be expressive with your colors on your lips because it clashes. So um, when I change this hair, I don't know if I'm going to... Do red again, but I definitely will miss it. I will definitely miss the red hair. It's it pops. Um, shedding. Um, I didn't seal my vest. I did receive vest sealer, but I didn't seal my vest. I was really busy. Um, I didn't seal my vest, so I do get shedding. It's not excessive. It's not overbearing. It's not balls of hair coming out. So, um, shedding would be good. I think shedding is actually minimal and it's normal. Shedding is normal. There's no hair that will not shed unless it's Filipino hair because, um, I didn't have shedding with my Filipino hair. But then again, shedding also depends on how you carry your hair. Um, what you do with it, what products you put in it, and all of that stuff. So that's a whole another video. But um, shedding for this hair is very, it's very limited. I don't have a lot of shedding. Um, tangles. My hair never tangles. Some people complain about hair tangling from Filipino hair to Russian hair. It's just how you care for your hair. I don't get tangles. Tangles are non-existent in my head. Um, Combing and brushing with a paddle brush will eliminate tangles. If you don't comb your hair on a day-to-day -day basis, the day that you do decide to comb through your hair, obviously you will get tangling and you will get shedding. I comb my hair every day. I comb my hair probably like 25 times a day. I run my hands through my hair constantly. I run my hands through, run my hands through. And that kind of eliminates the knots and tangles too. So, um, There is nothing that I can really add to this hair other than it's great. The curl pattern is gorgeous. The texture is really, really nice. It's um, a very light type hair that moves. Like if you move this hair, it moves with you. It's it's fluffy. It's it's also thick, so you have a uh, you know a way of getting away with two bundles or three bundles because it's thick. It it does not. It's not. It's not light, but it's thick in a good way. Like, if you do a 12 and 14, definitely that will work. A 14 and 16, 16 and 18. Some people even get away with the 18 and 20. But three bundles, for me, three bundles, four bundles is perfect. But um, if you can only do two, or if you only like two bundles, you don't like that much hair on your head, two bundles, you can get away definitely with this hair because it's really full. My hair is not looking that full today because I have it, I just washed it and like I said it's damp because I can feel like in the roots inside, kind of wet, kind of not really wet but damp and not I don't like this, this amount, I do like this amount but for me it's not going to stay like this because I run my hands through my hair daily so it tends to 
get bigger but if you want your hair to stay like this text this this size when you wash your hair just leave it you can tussle it or whatever but don't do the dragging your hands through and stuff like that so I'm just gonna do like a close-up sorry I'm gonna do a close-up so you can see the curls the ends of my hair are gorgeous no split ends color is nice it's a red ombre all you girls who were afraid of red try red red is pretty and it's pretty on all skin colors dark dark to light light it's really pretty so this is the end of my video and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was informative for you and please rate subscribe and comment if you have any questions about platinum virgin platinum extensions virgin here Check them out on Facebook. You can search Platinum Hair Extensions on Facebook. And um, the numbers, the numbers for Platinum Hair Extensions, Danielle 2447916. If you can't get Danielle, you could call me to ask me any question that you want. Um, my number is 2418266. You can also find me and ask me about extension installs. I do sewings I do my own sewings and stuff like that so um see you in another video guys Bye.